Welcome to your midweek minute. It's your Pastor Daryl here from Washington Church of the Nazarene from Washington, Indiana. How is everybody doing? I hope this finds you well. Uh, going to keep it again short and sweet today, but I, you know, I keep going back to this message this last week and, and I brought the kids up and I had a bunch of stuff in front of them and most of it cleaning supplies and disinfectant and you know, I got this bar of soap here that, that was on there and I said, uh, well, what are these things? And they, they, they said, well, that's soap. Well, what do you do with it? You wash your hands. How do you wash your hand? You put it on your hand. So I said, all right, great. And I put it on my hand. What? No, no, no. You're not supposed to put it on your hand. Put it on the other part of your hand. Oh, okay. So I put it on there. No, no, no. You're supposed to take it out. No, we take it out. And then we wash it. And they said that you use water and you wash your hands and you rub them and you dry them. And we went through a process. And the point is we have steps to take to be able to wash our hands effectively, to clean ourselves. And we, the sermon was all about cleansing the temple. But it also got me thinking about these disciplines that we do as Christians, as believers in the faith, as, as followers of Jesus Christ, we have disciplines, certain things that we do every single day that help us grow in our faith, help us become closer to Jesus Christ and show more of him and less of us. Um, this here is a list of, this is what we pray over every Tuesday night. And uh, one of my disciplines is I come in every morning and I kneel at the altar with this list and I go over people's names of medical needs and, and spiritual needs and other needs, people that are grieving losses, and, and I give thanks for everything that he's done through this church and through the ministry of the church, and we pray for the services, and we do this every day. Now, so what are some of your disciplines? You know, in order to have a great relationship with the Lord, we it needs work. We can't just set it on our hand. We can't, you can't open up a Bible and read. That's just that's the equivalent of putting soap on our hand and not and expecting our hands to get clean. We have to go through work. We have to put in effort. So you want a better relationship with Jesus Christ? What are your disciplines? Don't have any? It's a great time to start one. I'll, give, I'll challenge you. Why don't you list in the comment section to, right here, right down below what your disciplines are. Maybe give an idea to someone who doesn't have a discipline and, and looking to start one. You know, I, I do my prayer time every morning, but I also do some silence and solitude. Um, I get a lot of silence and solitude time during staff meetings here. That's an inside joke. We have a staff of one. Um, but silence and solitude, Bible reading, Bible study, prayer time, what is something that you do regularly just between you and the Lord? I'm looking forward to seeing you this next week. If you do not have a church home and you're in the Southwest Indiana area, please come by and see us. We'd love to have you. For all those tuning in online, we love you, I'm praying for you, and until next week, have a great rest of your week.